Uh, good afternoon, everyone. Uh, I'm Chang Bo Guo, and this is my college, Ho Ming Wang. We are from uh, Yi Stack. Today, we will introduce Yes Cast version 2, one platform for bare VM, and container. So let's see the agenda. First, I will introduce Easy Stack briefly, then see what we did in ESCast version 1, and what's the updates in ESCast version 2. And the last, we will do a demo. Easy Stack is a leading open stack cloud, cloud platform and service provider. Two days ago, EasyStack was uh, accepted as a gold member of OpenStack Foundation. Soft software engineers from EasyStack have been contributing OpenStack from S House. So, in the la last uh, release, Mitaka, EasyStack is one of the top contributors. And in the same release, two of our engineers was nominated and uh, approved as project code reviewer. We provide uh, uh, cloud uh, development and service for more than 10, uh, more than 100 and enterprise customers, including State Grid, China Telecom, Lenovo, Post Saving Bank of China, Xunfeng, Group, TCL, and Tsinghua University. Uh, you can find more customer use keys from our official website. So what is ES uh, CAS? It is a self-service control platform. You can spring up dedicated OpenStack cloud in minutes. It provides more flexible service and better control your cloud environment with stronger security. Uh, it provides dedicated host, isolated networking, uh, exclusive storage. So let's see, this is an uh, architecture. This, this picture, there are three areas, the center and the left and the right. Each areas include the uh, resources, include the uh, network, host, and the storage. The, in the center areas, they, they are shared uh, resources. All users from uh, any domains can access them. But in the left and the right, they are specific uh, dedicated resources. It's only accessed for specific domain. So if you want uh, high performance and uh, stronger security, you can add uh, domain specific uh, uh, dedicated resources to the domain user. This is the ES class versus UI. In the left, there are two panels, the public and the dedicated cloud. When you log in as the domain, administrator, you can add three type of dedicated resources. It includes compute, storage, and networking. Each type have different tabs. I mean, uh, also the different flavors. For example, for the computer resources, you can add uh, more, uh, more, uh, more CPU cards and RAMs. When you add the resources to specific domain, then you can see what we have and uh, what's available for specific domain. In this web, there are, there are three type of resources, the CPU. You can see there are, there are only two houses with small type, and the story results with type HDD, and uh, the networking. The difference be, uh, between the normal OpenStack and the dedicated cloud, the difference is you, 
the user can put a yes test in a normal OpenStack environment or dedicated result, uh, dedicated cloud. We demoed the yes cast version one in the Tokyo summit. So if you, uh, you need more information, you can visit the link. So what's the updates in ES class, class version 2? First, it, it is our dimensional data center operating system based on OpenStack. It can orchestrate your cloud native application in, frame, in frameworks like Mesos, Kubernetes, and Swarm. It's also a unified platform for container cluster and allocation, creating, and monitoring. Uh, the, uh, Ho Ming, my colleague Ho Ming will introduce more details and demo it. It's your turn, Ho Ming. OK. Uh, good afternoon, everyone. I'm Ho Ming from Easy Stack. In the next, I will uh, give, me, give you some detail of our ES class version 2 and uh, uh, I will do a live demo, uh, a live demo. Uh, first, we can see the uh, architecture of the uh, ES class version 2. And uh, as Jonathan said in yesterday keynote, OpenStack is, uh, uh, is an integrated open stacks. It's an integrated engine for uh, all the open uh, source projects. And uh, uh, OpenStack is for infrastructure primitives. And uh, it uses uh, projects like Nova, Glance, Neutron, Cinder, Keystone, or Swift to manage uh, infrastructure in your data center. And uh, based on that, uh, some pro application primitives projects like Heat, Sahara, Magnum, uh, it can uh, your can provide the application power to the end user. And on top of that, we OpenStack uh, also embrace the cloud native frameworks uh, like uh, Kubernetes, Mesos, and so on. And uh, uh, demo time. And uh, I will uh, demo how yes cast version 2 to uh, quickly provision and uh, uh, Docker cluster and uh, applications. Here we go. First, we log in. This is the overview, overview page of the uh, cloud admin. And uh, we can turn to the project admin overview. Here we can see the uh, resource quota usage of this tenant. And uh, uh, on the above, we can see the cluster uh, monitor information and the application running in the cluster. This is the cluster uh, CPU usage, and this is the cluster RAM uh, running uh, nodes in this cluster. And this is uh, uh, running applications. Uh, right now, I will create uh, container clusters and ab applications. First, create a cluster. Hello, Austin. Uh, for demo, we only create one master node and uh, one slave node. Uh, and we can say the cluster is uh, created in process. From the instance list,
we can say the uh, washing machine is being created, and uh, uh, the container uh, cluster is, uh, is being configured in the background. Uh, this may take uh, two or uh, three minutes. the uh, create in process because it uh, needed some time to download the uh, images uh, and the network speed is not fast enough Let's check. Okay, we can see the two VM is uh, all created, and uh, the cluster is being ready in a moment. Okay, we can see the new cluster uh, is uh, created complete, and uh, then I will create two applications based on this cluster. For uh, for demo, I will create a uh, WordPress application, uh, and uh, it, contain, it, it contained by two applications. One is MySQL, and uh, the other is WordPress. First, MySQL. And we choose which cluster to uh, run this application. And we choose the new cluster, Hello Austin. Image name, version. And uh, we add a mount point. We increase the CPU and uh, memory. And my circle service port. It's three three two eight two six TCP, and uh, I will set the my circle password. Okay. UI network, uh, maybe the network is down. I can't uh, operation the, the horizon. 
uh, we uh, also record the uh, move, demo movie, so we can see uh, see the the record, the demo record. This is uh, the application created. First, my circle image washer. My circle. And we can say my circle is being created and uh, uh, running. Next, we create WordPress. Uh, WordPress image. CPU memory, and uh, set the uh, uh, environment parameters. I'll see. Mm -hmm. And we can see both WordPress and MySQL is running on the clusters. And then we, we can see uh, the two cluster is uh, in the overview page. We can say the uh, cluster usage and uh, the application usage data. And then we look into the uh, WordPress. And the new WordPress is uh, running in the container cluster. Hello. Okay. Yeah, sorry. Sorry. Okay, this is uh, all, all the demo. Yes. Okay, thanks for me. Yes, in the Austin Summit, we bring two customer case studies from the Lenovo and uh, the state grid coverage of China. So uh, if you need more information, please find us in the booth A21. Thanks, everyone. Thank you.